Hello and welcome to another video tutorial from ComputerGaga.com This tutorial will look at highlighting dates that are over 30 days old. This task came up because of a question I was asked in training recently and what we need to do is we need to use conditional formatting to highlight these cells and we're going to need to create our own criteria. Now I've got some dates on screen at the moment and two of the dates are over 30 days old. Today's date is the 7th of March 2012, so the date in A3 and the date in A5 should be formatted on the completion of this task. Okay, let's get on with it. First things first, select the dates, select the range that you want to apply the conditional format in rule 2. Then from the home tab, we'll go to conditional formatting and we're going to choose a new rule. So we can create our own rule. From select a rule type, we're going to select only cells that contain, former only cells that contain. And we're going to say the cell value is less than, and it's going to be less than today's date. If I use the today function, that will find what today's date is. Today is the 7th of March 2012. And I'm going to subtract 30 from it. If the date in the cell is less than, whether two's, today's date is minus 30, then it must be over 30 days old. I'm finally just going to click the format button and apply some formatting to themselves. Always a fan of just filling the colour red. You click OK. I can see that cell A3 and cell A5 are highlighted as they are the only two dates over 30 days old. Because I've used the today function, this can remain there now. If I had selected the whole column and more dates are added as more transactions occur, they will highlight themselves as they go greater than 30 days because of the use of the function as an alternative to actually type in today's date. Hope you found it useful. Thank you for watching. Please check out some of our other videos on our YouTube channel or other tips and tutorials at computergargar.com.